Hey, what's up, guys? Christian here, back with another video. I'm gonna try to do this fast because I had to take pictures at my uh, high school game last night, and I was supposed to take them, you know, with the school's uh, camera, and I forgot my SD card because I'm really smart, so I had to do it with my phone. But <laughs> so don't have much storage left, so I'm gonna try to do this as fast as possible so I don't run out. But if I do, I'll just put the pics that I didn't say in the description. But I'd say I'll probably be fine. Because it's mainly pictures, not many videos. Anyway, uh, here were our picks last week. Um, as you can see, we both went 10 and 9. So, now in the year, I'm 129 and 63. And Zephian is 127 and 65. He's not sent me his picks yet. But when he does, I'll put them in the description as always. Like I always do. I don't know why I said always twice. Um, focus. There we go. West Virginia at number 12, Baylor. We both took Baylor here, so we both got the week started with a win. Number 14, Michigan and Maryland. I think uh, Michigan goes out and uh, wins this game. They looked a lot better than they did last week. Um, that was actually kind of impressive, but, you know... <laughs> Notre Dame just didn't look very interested, though. So, I'm still going with Michigan there, though. NC State and... Hold on. There we go. NC State and number 23, Wake Forest. I'm going with Wake Forest there. Um, no, I just think they're the better team there. And, you know, in... At Wake Forest, I couldn't remember what their... Winston-Salem. Yeah, there we go. It's in Winston-Salem, so I think Wake Forest gets the win there. Uh, no, we're not picking that one. There we go. Boston College at Syracuse. I think uh, Syracuse gets the win there. Um, two teams that are kind of fighting for bowl games, I guess. But, you know, shoot, I forgot they're in Clemson's division. But the other side of that, the ACC is pretty much wide open. So, but... Yeah, again, they're in Clemson's division, so I've got Syracuse there, though, and it's probably going to be pretty much a meaningless game. Next game, I don't have the helmets for Virginia Tech at number 16, Notre Dame. I'm going with Notre Dame there even after last week, but to be honest, I would not be surprised to see Virginia Tech make that a game at all. But, you know, I think uh, Notre Dame comes out and does get the win, though. Um, number 22, Kansas State at Kansas. Uh, Kansas got the win last week against Texas Tech in a crazy game. Uh, Kansas State coming off beating Oklahoma, so I've got Kansas State there. I think they take the momentum from that game last week and uh, this week, and they beat Kansas there. Uh, there we go. Miami at Florida State. Uh, you know, a game that's usually a big game. They're both four and four this year, so it's not as big of one as it usually is. But I still have. I I have Miami getting the road win there. Um, I've just liked Miami a little bit better this year than I have Florida State, so I've got Miami getting the win there. TCU at Oklahoma State. TCU coming off the Texas win, uh, you know. But I think Oklahoma State gets them here in Stillwater. It's a hard place to go in, so I'm going Oklahoma State there. Whew. Uh, Utah. At number or number nine, Utah at Washington. Hold on, I gotta get my notebook closer. Oh shoot! This is taking forever. I'm sorry. There we go. Um, yeah, number. Shoot, what was? I, yeah, there. We go. Number nine, Utah at Washington. Sorry, I I just woke up, so you're gonna have to bear with me. Number nine, Utah at Washington. I've got Utah there. Uh, Washington's just really struggling right now, um, compared to what they're off-season expectations were, so I've got Washington there to get the win. Um, what was I about to do? Oh, yeah. Uh, Mississippi State at Arkansas. I've got uh, Mississippi State winning that game. You know, I I wouldn't pick Arkansas against so many teams right now. Uh, no offense, but they're, they're pretty bad. They are bad, honestly. Um, but, yeah, I, I've still got Mississippi State there, even though it is in Fayetteville and all that. But Mississippi State's struggling right now, too. They're pretty bad, too. But I think Arkansas is worse. 
Um, Pittsburgh at Georgia Tech. I've got Pittsburgh winning that game. Um, you know, Georgia Tech and Pitt, Pittsburgh still fighting for the whatever division Clemson's not in. I, I always forget the name of that division. I'm sorry, but yeah, Pittsburgh's still fighting for a division championship. Georgia Tech's kind of just here, but uh, I, I'm going with Pitt there to get the win in Atlanta. What was the next game? Yeah, got to go back over here. Ole Miss at number 11, Auburn. You know, Auburn looked good last week, even in a loss. So, I think they take out their frustrations this week and beat Ole Miss by double digits. Um, Let's see. Another game not on here. Uh, number 15, SMU at 24, Memphis. This is where college game day is. Should be a great game. But everyone's... Uh, ki- you know, blowing gas up Memphis's, you know, you know what. Uh, and I think SMU finds a way and they get the upset on the road at Memphis. Um, I just think SM, I just like SMU better just as a football team. I think they're more complete than Memphis. A lot of people are going to disagree with me on that, but I'm going with SMU there, uh, going against what most people think about that game. So, okay, what's next? Think Christian. There we go. Uh, Virginia at North Carolina. You know, that should be a pretty good game. Again, both these teams fighting for the division championship. This I think this game determined the lead. And I'm going with North Carolina to get the win there at home. Uh, you know, that's one of those games. If it was at Virginia, I'd probably take Virginia. But I'm going North Carolina there. Uh, yeah. Number seven, Oregon at USC. I'm going with Oregon there. Uh, I think they find a way to get that done in, at USC, but don't be surprised to see USC make that a game. Uh, three more games. Number eight, Georgia at number six, Florida. Everyone, you know, I don't know why this game has George, is Georgia's favorite by six in this game. I, would under, I understand Georgia being favored, but not by this number. It, I don't think it's going to matter either way. I think Georgia uh, comes out sloppy like they have the last two weeks. That's why I'm kicking Florida to beat Georgia today. Um, UAB at Tennessee. I'm very scared. I'm more nervous about this game than I am next week against Kentucky. I'm just going to be honest. And I think we come out and get the win, but not with a lot of confidence. And then finally, Vanderbilt at South Carolina. I think... South Carolina comes out, takes their first surgeons out from last week, and beats Vanderbilt pretty handily. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll talk to you again later.